Hi peer students, my name is Mario and I'm one of your librarians. In this video, we will introduce an overview of the main library resources that you should know about. Starting in our website, this is our homepage. If you do not know how to get here, you can easily go to peerscollege.edu and there is a library tab on the left hand side. Once you get to our landing page, the first thing that you might notice is the box called OneSearch. So OneSearch is a search engine that looks through all of our databases at the same time. So it's our quick way to let you search for any type of source. Ebooks, print books, academic journals, magazines, newspapers, etc. Now, if you want to look at all of our databases individually, we have a tab that reads databases A through Z. And if you open that one, it shows you all of our databases in alphabetical order. You have access to all of these databases, even off campus. You just have to click on them from our website and our website will ask you for your student ID number as a username and your passcode is your birthday without the year. So month and date of birth, four digits. Now in our databases, you could filter or sort, sort them out based on the academic discipline or even the type of database such as ebooks or databases that focus on films and videos. The next thing you should know is that we do have research workshops that you can take. Right now we have this banner on our homepage and if you click on it, it will take you to some instructions on how you can enroll into our Canvas course where you can take the workshops that are located in our modules. And some professors might be offering extra credit for you to take these research workshops. Right now they're open for the summer sessions and this page, like I said, guides you on how to enroll and how to start taking those workshops. So even though the library building might be physically closed, we are open digitally through our website and you can always ask librarians for help. For example, on the lower right hand corner, you might see this chat box pop up. That means that there's a Pierce librarian ready to chat with you virtually. If you do not see that, you can still chat with librarians through our homepage there is a help tab at the bottom left hand corner and right here you can start chatting with a real librarian even though it might not be a Pierce librarian but they can help you with our databases navigating our website or even any research question that you might have it's a nationwide service where a lot of academic librarians contribute to this feature Another thing we want you to know about is subject guides. So in our menu, we have this tab called subject guides, which lists all of the library guides that librarians have created to help you or guide you through your research process. Now, most of the subject guides are focused on departments or disciplines, such as communication studies, or political science, um, but we also have one specifically on literary criticism. And down here we have research guides, and one of our most popular ones is citing your sources. So once you get started with your research papers and organizing your citations, you might need some references as to how MLA 8th or APA 7th work. And lastly, we want to remind you to follow us on Instagram. In our homepage, we have the Instagram icon at the bottom. And if you click on that, it will take you to our Instagram account. Our username is Pierce Library, very simple. So I hope you can find us and follow us. And thanks for watching.